Ooh, they got one of my guys. Got a caravan goer. I'll avenge you, caravan guard. Four body and no leg. I can take this male shirt. It's way better body and leg armor. And it would slow me down some, but I'm I spend most of my time on uh, horseback anyway, so it'd be worthwhile. Let's see here. So now I'm dressed basically exactly like a Norse guy. If I do that, all right. Well. It'll do. Let's see. Let's head on over to Kara. to have there's Clethy Artemenor. This guy's an engineer. Never run into him before. Let's see if there's a ransom broker up here. I doubt there will be. Ooh, this place is cramped. Oh, that's just the shitter. Alright, the goods merchant. Anybody here? Yeah, I don't want to work with these guys anyway. over to Sargath. Gonna see if they have any uh, ransom brokers. Ooh, wait, that's a whole bunch of different Jarls. And they're having a feast. I can't, I can't join because I don't have enough renown. I did win a tournament, but it wasn't in this area, so maybe it doesn't count. Let's go talk to Jarl Hedda. Do you have any tasks? Alright. I think I didn't have any other. Oh, well. None of these guys have anything they need doing. <sighs> I'm 
It's one of my cats outside. You may be able to hear them. That's, uh, that's Spaz. Short for spasms. There's a disagreement in our family on what that's short for. Yeah, go ahead and let's pass in. Uh, could use soda, but uh, if, if you just want to give me the last of the uh, sparkling grape juice, yeah, I'll do the last of sparkling grape juice. That way, we'll get it out of the fridge at least. And sea raiders, five sea raiders is worth pretty much a whole week's worth of expenses. So. Delicious. Alright. Let's see. That is, um... <laughs> you may be hearing is my cat Spaz as I've uh, said before uh, really likes to help out with anything I happen to be doing typing on a computer playing with a mouse standing around cooking whatever he wants in on it he's very helpful just consistently very helpful for any task that Spaz yeah and if ever you need a uh, headbutt, he's, he's your man. He will headbutt you right in the face. Not a second thought. Uh, let's see. Let's all go talk to the Jarl, see if he's got anything for me to do. Uh, Army is at uh, 43, mostly uh, infantry, some horsemen. I hired a bunch of uh, farmers, but they actually slowed me down a lot. Oh, good. Yeah. Okay. One of these guys actually had something for me to do. So I ended up letting the farmers go. Uh, I spent a little while hunting uh, sea raiders because they're worth a lot of money. That worked out fairly well for me. Uh, let's see here. Any tasks? No. That was Jarl Remald. Jarl Rayek. Do you need anything? And your old Aiden. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's always a pain when you get to watch in, in super fast motion as the guys who's got who've got you captive run around until you either escape or you get ransomed. And then you've just got you. You gotta build everything up again. I'm not starting any wars. Let's see. Jarl Turia. See if you got anything for me to do. Alright. <laughs> but it's interesting. It's a way for them to continue the game even after you lose. So, I mean, you don't always actually lose and die. Sparkling grape juice from a party we threw a while back. It's good stuff. Let's see. Let's go talk to that person purring into the microphone. It is Chloe. Uh, I use the word person loosely. Chloe's cat has to investigate every single possible thing. Go to the merchant. Need anything from here? Uh, we just just came from here. Mm. 
All right, let's look at factions. Who are the Nords at war with? Oh, nobody. That's that's actually really weird. That's usually they're at war with somebody. Either the Vagers or the. Uh, Somebody. I'll help this guy out. He doesn't need it. But... It's just forest bandits. He's got a full complement of Nords. But he had a very really small one. Dead Island 3 eventually when that comes out. You can get that, right? Yeah, I don't know if I'll get it for PlayStation 2, I mean PlayStation 4 or for PC. <laughs> if I get it for PlayStation 2, there's something weird going on with that game. There, there's always something weird going on with me. Let's go over to Tier. I've tried to play the original Mountain Blade, and I've tried to play, uh, what is it, Fire and Sword. Mm -hmm. I, honestly, I did not like with Fire and Sword very much. Uh, the, the guns in it just seemed, uh, added a, a element to the, the general flow of the gameplay that I didn't like, because I like running around and stabbing the hell out of dudes. I don't like sitting in orderly lines shooting dudes with muskets. This is not my it's not my jam, to put it simply. Oh, I'm using outdated slang. It's groovy. It's, it's, <laughs> it's, it's not groovy to I don't know, stand in lines and shoot at each other. 